Hi there, Andre and Suzanne, it's me. I'm going to show you those exercises that will help your wrist and your lower arm and even your upper arm. Um, I just give you a little history of my problems. Uh, obviously, it's been uh, working on the computer too much and what I thought was carpal tunnel, which probably was. Um, I found when I went to a yoga retreat that um, there are exercises that you can do to prevent it and also to correct it instead of having uh, surgery. Now the operation is to, I mean not the operation, but the exercise is to, I usually go on all fours because I get perfect right angles, but I'm going to do this on a table, okay? So um, here we go. I would like you to try and um, have your right angles like this this and I would like you to try and move your elbows so that the inner elbow faces each other like this okay now what that what that does is it pulls the muscles that are attached to your wrist and your ligaments that attach to your elbow and also these muscles here they're all working in harmony all of them you know, your wrist and your elbow and your shoulder, they're all working. Now, when I started this, I couldn't do it on my own, so I actually had to manually move my elbow so that it would face in. That really hurt, and I had to, at the very beginning, occasionally take an ibuprofen to get the swelling down. Now, if you can't take that, um, ice will help or whatever, but it will hurt. But please continue. You know, it's hurting because they haven't been used in a long time. So once you can do that, um, yeah, it, you, you will find that your arms are getting stronger up here, your elbow, joints, and your wrist. Now, when you can, or if you can't, but just work toward it, um, I want you to do circular movements with your hands and in right angle with your rest of your arm. Do circular movements for your wrists and what that is doing also, it's using those muscles that are attaching to your wrist. Now go one way and then go the other way. <clears throat> okay, see I'm trying, it's hard to keep your inner elbows facing each other but it really is important because again it places the bone structure and the muscles in the place that it should have been. and and it will strengthen both your whole arm. Now the other one is to do it the other way, like this. Now this for me hurts, which tells me that I probably should have been doing this. So do circles. Okay, and then do it the other way. There we go. Yeah, so I haven't been doing it and obviously I have to, <laughs> okay? There, and then just give your hand a massage and your elbow, just a nice massage, okay? Yeah, there, and then go back and do it again, but don't overdo it. I think you can actually throughout the day just remember to do that and it'll get stronger and stronger. And I really hope this helps and you avoid any type of intrusive surgery. Now the other thing that I often do is, no, I only have a glass of wine on the right side if it's afternoon and evening. And if it's in the morning, I have a cup of coffee because I can't stand to see the light. <laughs> and that's probably because of the wine in the evening. Just kidding. Namaste.